Hello and welcome to the Dennis Bloodlock channel. And now we have 1080p footage, again shot with the Nikon D750 using the Nikkor 50mm f1.4 lens and in this case we are shooting at 60 frames per second, 60p. And so when you run into this issue of the flickering footage, an issue which is related to the type of lighting that you use. And now shooting with the same lens and camera combination, D750 50mm lens, we are shooting 1080p video at 30p. Now if, like myself, on the majority of your video footage you use battery powered lighting equipment, and I've got a link to my review of my battery powered lights. Uh, the link will be in the top right of this section of the video. When you use battery powered lights, you are using direct current and therefore the lights are literally on permanently. Whereas if you are reliant on lighting which is powered by mains electricity, electricity which is alternating current and alternates at a certain uh, frequency, here in the UK 50 Hertz, it means that as such the lights are switching off and switching back on again 50 times per second. Now to the ordinary eye this isn't visible, but when you play back footage which is not necessarily shot at 50 frames per second, then you can run into flickering issues as the video footage following this section will show. Hi there, my name is Lottie Rose. Hey, I'm Jessie. And I'm Bianca J. And welcome, welcome to, to the Dennis Bloodnock channel. So, on the Nikon D750, how do you alter your videos to ensure that you don't run into this problem? Well, you switch the camera on and enable live view. So it's a good idea to actually remove the lens cap. And as you may be able to see, there is a certain flickering on the screen there due to the fact that it is set up to use 60 frames per second. Now, what I use, I go to the I menu there, the I button, bottom left, and there we are. You choose the frame size and frame rate, and in this case, we have selected 24 frames per second, 1080p. And all I am going to do is move to 50p. And I don't know how much that comes across in the video, but all of a sudden the flickering sensation has gone. And I'll show that in the next section of video coming now. Hello, YouTubers. This is 1080p video shot on the Nikon D750 with the Nikkor 50mm f1.4 G lens. In this case, the 1080p footage is shot at 50p, 50 frames per second. Hello and welcome to the Dennis Bloodnock channel.